Ladies and gentlemen, tonight's opening contest is scheduled for one four. It has a 10 minute time limit. And it is for the Canadian Unified Junior Heavyweight Championship. <laughs> Introducing first the challenger. He likes flips, he hates bread. Lock up your daughters, it's Falcon Pen! Belltown to get this one underway. Canadian Unified Junior Heavyweight Championship on the line. A massive opportunity for the Falcon Kid, the blue and black celiac who locks up the head trainer at the Fale Dojo, Tony Casino. Here tonight at IPW Homecoming. Very agile from the Falcon Kid, rolling through, catches Tony Casino in an armbar. Try and dial up the pressure for the man from Portland, Oregon. The Kazina takes Kid down, standing on the back of the knee. And now he is in control with a wrist lock. So fundamentally sound is Tony Kazina. That's why he's had a hand in the training of some of the most successful wrestlers around the world today, including the likes of Davy Richards. Kyle O'Reilly, former IPW champion Travis Banks, and of course, the underbox, Bad Luck Fale. Falcon Kid sweeps the leg. Ties Kazina up, unique submission attempt. Dialing up the pressure, and now rolls into the cover. Has he got him? And this audience showing their respect for both of these men, very evenly matched thus far. Let's go, Falcon! No, shut up. <laughs> Ted and Kazina try to feel each other out again, but Kazina picks the leg. Takes the Falcon Kid down to the mat. This is a kick. Roll up. Look out. And if you 
seen the Falcon Kid in action before. You know this man, he loves to fly. He's got that agility. He loves that adrenaline, thrill-seeking offense. But right now, really holding his own against Tony Kazina in the technical wrestling aspect. And he applies a side headlock. Shot from the midsection, trying to break out of this hold, and another. Good stuff and get off the ropes. Kid rolls through. Catches it. Oh, neck breaker. Kazina adjusting his wrist tape there. He homes in on the Falcon Kid. Takes him over the snapmare. And rattles his spine with a drop kick to the back of the neck. Big clubbing blow from Tony Kazina. Falcon Kid backed up into the corner. And Kazina pours the pressure on. Shot to the chest, Falcon Kid in a great deal of pain. The headbutt from Casino. Falcon Kid hung up on that top rope with a modified suplex. Zena off the ropes. Another drop kick connects. Look out, has he got him here? Falcon Kid lucky to get his hand on that bottom rope. Tony Kazina really bringing the fight to this young man. But do not count the Falcon Kid out. Picked down to the canvas, but he's back. Fighting his way back up to his feet. A big Spartan style kick. Knocks him down again. Slap to the face from Tony Kazina, but Falcon Kid answers with one of his own. Oh, Irish whip counter. Kazina hit those turnbuckles hard. This is Falcon Kid's chance to put him away. The Falcon looking to fly. Well, oh. another shot that there. Looked like Kazina moved slightly. Nobody home either way. Trying to give him a receipt from that earlier chop. Oh, big back drop. Look at the elevation on that one. High up into the clouds. And now Falcon Kid, has he done enough? Kid's got to be careful not to get frustrated here, Ian. Oh, absolutely. This is the... This is the thing about youth versus uh, the veteran. The veteran knows exactly what to do. Youth sometimes gets overexcited. Oh! Falcon Kid looking at that subset flip, but he was just crushed by a double stop to the chest. Oh, and that is what I'm talking about. The veteran tone, he just knowing exactly what to do in every situation. And here, Falcon Kid gasping for breath. 
and all the air driven out of those lungs because he's in a bad, bad way right now after that double stomp. And Tony Cusina looking to continue to pour on the pressure using that middle rope to set Falcon Kett up. Oh, oh, that is a bad night getting worse for Falcon Kett. All of Cusina's body weight crashing down on the upper back and the neck of Falcon Kett as he's hung up on that rope. Oh, just those vicious clubbing forearms. Punishing, punishing shots from Kazina. Really, the ref needs to get him off the rope, though. Falcon oh. Kid moved out of the way just in time, and Kazina takes a tumble. I'm not sure about that. Kazina did not look like he landed comfortably. Referee checking on both men. And now, beginning to count Kazina out. If I was the Falcon Kid, I would take a, I would take the count out win and just uh, put it on the resume and move on. Well, that seems to be the difference between you and the Falcon Kitty. And look at this, back of the ring, Kid stirring, getting back to his feet. It's not the only difference between me and the Kid. <laughs> Tell you that. You can eat food, can't you? Apparently so. Kazina back in avoids the count out, and now Falcon Kid looking to engage in a battle of strikes. Oh. Kid firing up. This is his chance. Rocks Kazina with a roundhouse to the head. The kid really needs to capitalize here. I think he should have gone for a pin. This didn't work last time. Let's see if. Catches him again with that moonsault. Into the cover, hook of the leg here. Kazina in trouble. Only two. Once again, may not have got all of that moonsault. Falcon Kid desperately trying to come up with something to finish this match. And he hits the Falcon Arrow. Still not enough to put away the veteran. One of his signature maneuvers, the Falcon Arrow from Falcon Kid. Ineffective tonight. Them with a shoulder. Oh, oh, vicious move there. Looks like Falcon Court is thrown across that top turnbuckle. Tony Kazina, a ring general, if ever I saw one, aware of where he is in the ring and what he can do with those parts of the ring. Cause great damage. Oh, Springboard Bulldog. Ken is down. the match, Tony Casina. You see, it started off dragging Falcon Kid into that top turnbuckle, that impact to the throat, and then Casina up and over, off the second, beautiful Bulldog. And he remains the Canadian Unified Junior Heavyweight Champion. That's right, definitely a lesson learned by Falcon Kid here tonight, but he can hold his own, he can hold his head up high, he did very well against an absolute ring victory. is over but
Riva, he leads with the respect of Tony Kazina here tonight in your opening match at IPW Homecoming.